Jane Wyman. Presented tonight by Ivory Soap. Advised by more doctors for baby's skin and yours. 99 and 44 one hundredths percent pure. It floats. And now, Jane Wyman. Good evening. Thank you for being with us again. They say, who are they that always say, but they always say that it's a pretty good idea to keep an eye on the future. Well, I agree with them, especially the future of our children. Now, I'm not one to make predictions, but I'm going to make an exception to that rule. I predict that you're going to just love our little ivory girl. Now, you wait and see. Rosemary ponders her perfect complexion, that ivory look. You'd like that ivory look. She'll show you the way. Simply use pure, mild ivory soap, gentle enough for a baby's skin. Use it regularly. Soon your complexion will look fresher and clearer. Like Rosemary, you'll have that ivory look. Your skin never outgrows ivory. Don't you agree? Now, you've heard people say something is unusual or exceptional. Well, in this case, it actually applies. Tonight, I play the part of Olivia Rayner, O-R. And those initials play an important part in our unusual story called No More Tears. I'll see you later. Thank you. Thank you. Attention, please. Immediately you can move up now. I say you can move up now. I guess you didn't notice. ticket. Well? I want a ticket to... Are you sick, lady? Oh. Never mind. Miss, wait a minute. Who forgot your bag? Thank you. You look sick. Is there anything I can do? Oh, I'm all right. I'll just go sit down. Attention, please. Passengers holding the return portion of round trip tickets required by the nation will please take their tickets to the validating desk. Sorry if I scared you, ma'am. 
Are you all right? Oh, yes, I'm... I'm fine. If you'd like to lie down? No, no, thank you. I'll just sit here and wait for my train. Maybe a glass of water. No, but you're very kind. Well, if you do need anything, ma'am... No, no, I won't need anything. But thank you. Why don't I know who I am? All right. I don't know who I am. That happens to people all the time. Lots of times. I'll start with what I can remember. If I can help you. No, thank you. I don't need any help. I'm quite all right. I was speaking to the other lady. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I get kind of nervous myself waiting for a train. You did say you were waiting for a train? Uh, yes. I said that. Do you have much of a wait? A wait? Well... Uh, not much. I don't... I'm not sure. I watch so many folks come and go. I'd like to take a trip. Get away from Philadelphia for a while. Philadelphia? Philadelphia? What train are you taking? What? What train are you taking? Train? Well, I'm... I'm taking the... the... It really doesn't matter, does it? No, ma'am. Yes, I, I'd like to freshen up a bit. Well, we have uh, private booths with wash. I know. I, I have a coin for one of the booths. Oh, man. Christopher, I don't have 
have to go crazy. I don't have... I'm not. I, I just can't remember. afraid. I don't know what I'm afraid of. Is it, is it something I can't face? Is it, is it something that, that I want to forget? Please help me to remember. I've, I've got to know. a value. She's seeking a buy. Well, what do you know? Both have found PSI. Sure, personal size ivory is the soap that they buy, and with simple subtraction, they'll show you just why. Look, with personal size ivory, you get one, two, three, four cakes for about the same price as just one, two, three cakes of other leading beauty soaps. And four minus three? Simple, one extra cake. You get one cake more with personal size ivory, just as though it's free. So next time you're shopping, take home PSI. Take four cakes, they'll give you your best bath time buy. Pure pleasure in the tub. That's personal size ivory. It floats, right in reach when you're ready. Suds is fast too, in half the time of other leading bath soaps. And those suds are special, pure and mild, so fresh feeling to your skin. Pure pleasure in every way. A bath with personal size ivory. Your best bath time buy is PSI, personal size ivory. Get personal size ivory in the new four cake beauty bundle. Four cakes wrapped up in one. You'll save. We 
have sandwiches, soup, and a couple of hot dishes. Just coffee, Black. Maybe a piece of pumpkin pie? It's nice and fresh. No, thank you. <laughs> okay. Say something? No, I. I was just reading the headlines. Makes you sick, doesn't it? Every holiday weekend, more people killed. It's awful. My wife wanted me to go to Atlantic City for a couple of days. I said, no, sir. You don't get me out in the car on a holiday weekend. Too many darn accidents. Well, of course there were accidents, but they still kill people just the same. I tell the wife, if people stayed home where they belong, these things wouldn't happen. All the money in the world couldn't get me to leave my home. Home. That's where I'll go. Home. Where to, lady? The Windover Arms. It's on... I know where it is. Just look at the city. Relax and look at the city. Maybe when I see my home, it... I want to get out. But you said that you wanted I to... I want to get out here. Okay, lady. Thank you. Riding in the park. Riding in the park. We... We can... That's right! I gotta get home! Mom will kill me! Come on! Oops, I'm sorry. Oh, that's all right, Timmy. My name's not Timmy. Timmy? Good evening. Yes, sir, I'll ring. Good evening, desk. Yes, sir, I'll have them bring it around. Oh, Mrs. Rayner, there were several calls for you. Well, don't put any calls through to me. I, I'm a little tired. Not even your husband, Mrs. Rayner? He's, he's tried to reach you three times. Oh, yes, of course, my husband. Some mail for you, Mrs. Rayner. Thank you. Doctor and Mrs. Christopher Rayner. Christopher. Christopher? Chris. Is anything wrong? Why, no. No, nothing.
forget you. I know you're not here because you're at Mother's. The trip was one of your birthday presents. Oh, it's coming back. It's, it's all beginning to come back, and it, it's not terrible at all. Nothing's the matter. Why was I so afraid? Yes, I'm fine. That's good. Chris? Yes? Nothing. I just wanted to say your name. I tried to call you before. Well, I... I've been away. But you're home now. That's good. Yes, I'm home. You sound tired, darling. I'm all right. I, I may be home soon. Mrs. Lambert's still holding off. Mrs. Lambert? Oh. <laughs> you mean the twins are still dawdling? Libby, did you laugh? Shouldn't I? Isn't it funny? Libby? Yes? I'll be home as soon as I can. Try to rest till I get there. Goodbye, darling. Oh, but Chris, why? Chris? Leave me, darling. Have a rough day? Not very. But well, come on, I'll mix you a drink. What did you do? Oh, nothing really. Did you say Mrs. Lambert was still dawdling about the twins? Indefinitely. Two babies. I can't imagine having two. I mean, two little ones. You know, I love you very much. I love you, too. You look tired, Chris. You've been working too hard. We're both tired, Livy. Chris? I see tears in your eyes. Sorry? Was well, there anything I can do? Just be with me. I miss Timmy. Don't you?
riding in the park and the horse shied. Oh! <laughs> I just thought you'd never cry, darling. It's all right. You need to cry. You must cry. What are we going to do? Day at a time. We'll live one day at a time. We'll have each other. Jane Wyman will join us again with news of next week's program. And now here's Gordon Dilworth of the Broadway hit show My Fair Lady with his guitar and another story about a colorful American. Yo ho, yo ho. On the deep blue seas off Cape Cod sails a fisherman named Wynn. Through the salty spray he hauls away with a hale and hearty grin. That healthy smile's no secret, with wisdom he is blessed. Cause Wynn each day fights tooth decay with a toothpaste they call Crest. Wynn's wise. You be wise too, cause chances are you've got soft spots in your teeth. And soft spots can turn to cavities unless you turn to Crest. Yes, Crest does something no other kind of toothpaste can do. Hardens those weak places. Stops them from turning into cavities. That's because of Crest's own special fluoride, Fluoristan. And Crest freshens your breath. Tastes wonderful. So make Crest your family toothpaste and put your fears to rest. Soft spots can turn to cavities unless you turn to Crest. Crest is best, Crest is best, Crest is best. Well, it's time to say goodnight again, but before we do, I want to show you a little bit of next week's story. Hold your arms up, woman. Mm -hmm. Hey! Oh, good, good. She's a little skittish, but I like them with spirit. It's called The Twenty Dollar Bride. <laughs> we hope you'll be with us, so until then, good night. Jane Wyman has been brought to you by Procter & Gamble's Crest Toothpaste with Floristan, the toothpaste that actually stops soft spots from turning into cavities, and ivory soap gentle enough for a baby's skin.